Welcome back to this Let's Play of EU4 to so continue as the Kingdom of God. We have uh, gathered an army into position in order to attack Spain here momentarily. Um, I was trying to think about a couple things. One was we got enough splendor to buy another ability. Not sure what we want. I don't think we need the other. Yeah, no, we don't need the other one that lowers liberty desire, I don't think, right now. We're in good shape there. And something else was we also gained our tech. We got our level 26 military tech, so we've got that morale I was talking about in the last video. We've got a nice morale boost because they just barely got done with their war they were in. And they just barely got to level 25. So we're going to have a nice tech lead over them that should allow us to just roll over them most likely. So I'm not sure. Maybe artillery bonus versus fort. That might be nice. That'll help us get our sieges done faster. Our coring distance, artillery damage from back row. I think we're going to go with that, actually. Let's take our artillery bonus versus the port. Napoleonic Wolf. Seems nice. Um, Other than that, I think we're in great shape to attack them. Let's see who will help us. Austria will. No surprise, because Austria is their rival. Hungary, oh, almost would. Like, we maybe we could manipulate it to get them to help us. We don't really need them to, though, I don't think. Let's see. Yeah, no. I was going to say we could buy some more trust and we could wait, but there's... I, I see no reason to do that. Like I said, by ourselves, we might be able to crush them just because of our high, our high tech. I'm guessing we could, but... I'll play it safe, we'll call it Austria, we'll take Imperialism so we can take extra, extra provinces again, why not? And, let's see, who do we have to deal with? Uh, Navarra, where's, oh, pff, okay, Navarra. Normandy, Burgundy, oh, a bunch of nobodies, wow. Okay, so yeah, we'll, we'll be good here, we'll be good here. How many ships do they have, anyways? They've got quite a good amount. I mean, this is between all their colonies, though, also. So they're not all going to be here currently. Oh, stability's not so good, though. Only one in a lot of these. Interesting. Hmm. All right, well, either way, let's send these three to, well... You know what? No, let's send these three here and then we'll send these three to Navarra yeah let's do that we can hit them from two sides I think 90,000 will be strong enough because they only have yeah I think I think we'll be okay because you got to remember like these numbers are high but they're spread all over the place kind of how we've got you know few hundred thousand just hanging out over here in the Middle East and in the Ottomans area and other areas just to keep control of the areas. They've kind of got to do the same thing. They're not just going to abandon the areas they're in. So, oh, hello, Mr. Navy. Let's go see if we can sink that. You screwed up, Spain. Where are you going? Tyrrhenian Sea over here. Okay, you, you run. Run, Spain. We're losing ships, but they're losing a bunch too. And these are heavies that they're losing. They're way more expensive. Nice. Yeah, we lost eight galleys for 13 heavies. Not really a problem. Um. Yeah, let's just send them back here and we'll let them repair now. We'll continue to siege these guys all down. Oh, we gained humiliation against St. Peter's, uh, Russia, which means we should be able to embargo. All right. Oh, Austria's already rushing in also. Excellent. I was hoping, yeah, I was going to say, okay, hopefully Austria will just smash some of these guys up here so we don't have to even, even deal with it. Navarra. Hopefully we can just piece Navarra out quick and give them to 
I don't even need any of these. Wow. We're at 100%. And then we can hopefully give that province to my vassal also. There we go. Okay, that's what we needed. I was say we need to break, break in here. Oh, whoa, where are they going? Okay, must be a problem with the this fort being there still. Must be blocking it, which is pretty annoying. But oh well. They're already trying to piece out. Who owns this right now? Let's give them to my vassal. I'm sure they're not gonna yeah they're not gonna give up yet they're close but not yet i didn't think so because for, i mean spain's still in the war at the moment so there's no reason for them to give up yet uh let's send my navy down here oh oh pause pause they turn the speed back down where's my oh there's my navy Good, good, good. Um, let's send this navy over here. I don't know if we can get there in time to help them, though. No. Unfortunately not. Alright, well, let's get a tick of repair, I suppose. There we go. Let's see if we can catch them out. Um, I need to continue to siege here. Nice. Sunk that fleet. Excellent. All these are bonus areas for galleys, except Gibraltar here and out. So you don't want to go to Gibraltar. You want to go to anywhere, if you read the tooltip here, right? It says straight to Gibraltar. It doesn't say anything. If you go to the next one, Gulf of Almeria, right under that, it says this is an inland sea. That's what you're looking for if you're using galleys. If it doesn't say that... Probably a dangerous idea to use them then. Who's this? Um... Oh, that's right. Spain has stuff up here. I forget sometimes they've got some of this junk. Burgundy wants to peace out, huh? Austria okay with this? Burgundy will cede Bacardi to Austria. Fine. I never did nothing for you, Austria. Normandy, um... Sure, just give me some money. That's fine. Who's left? Kilwa, I think, somewhere weird in Africa, maybe. Yeah, well, that's all the way over there, so don't I don't care. Brittany? Wait, what? Did Brittany declare war on them? No. Uh, let's see what they're doing. Ashanti, Kong, and Masi. Oh, they're just marching down to Africa. Okay, well, that's fine, I guess. Whatever. Where's... Uh, where's my navy? I'm completely not seeing it. Oh, there it is. I was going to say, I wanted to come over here and intercept these guys. How many ships do they have? A 62 transports? Oh, wow, well, there's 30 big ships, so that's not enough. I could just destroy this. Oh, 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 there they are. Hold them in place, knights. Oh, oh dang. Okay, um... What is this? Oh... Well, that's fine. I was gonna say which king, who is this one, but it's the uh, it's my vassal, who we want to give all these provinces to anyway, so that's fine. Don't want to give up yet, huh? All right, don't give up yet then. Just because it results in your full annexation, hey, it happens. Shouldn't have allied. You shouldn't have allied with Spain. It wouldn't have happened actually. <laughs> Just saying. 
Like how Hungry will come help us now? Yeah. <laughs> now that it appears you're winning... You know what? Yeah, let's just set my navy here, because that blocks all these ships in. They can't get out. Good. You know what? We could help them, actually, now that I think about it. I didn't... There we go. Oh, yeah. There we go. Send some... Oh, sunk all 30 of them. Nice. Might as well send some fresh ships in. Um... Where are these guys going? Gulf of Valencia. Can we catch them? Somebody's going to catch them, it looks like. It's not us, though. No, I can't get them fast enough. Uh, oh, let's gain an innovativeness. I don't care if any of these people don't like us. Oh no, the, the Ottomans may not like us. Oh no. <laughs> uh... Probably actually need eventually to send my fleet. Oh, where is my fleet? Wait a second. Get over there and help the auto. Oh, dang. Not gonna get there. I was gonna say get over there and help Austria, but they're not gonna make it. That's fine. Once they lose that siege, we'll we'll jump them. Uh, maintenance modifier, manpower modifier, morale. That's the kind of thing we want. Ornan and Kara. Discipline. Uh, get the morale. Let's boost him up to five, because once again, we've got plenty of money, so there's really no reason not to. Now if we could get a decent leader, it will really get those numbers skyrocketing. There we go. Oh, more conversions happening. Excellent. I think we're converting very, very quickly also, but having five is really nice. Uh, let's just keep sending everybody to neighboring countries, I guess. There we go. Caught that fleet that we were waiting for. Where are these guys going? Barbary Coast. Let's see if we can catch them. Can. Yeah, got one. We only got one transport. We only killed one transport out of that whole thing, huh? Speaking of, let's grab that, move that up there. And I guess move this over here. We'll let him get a repair tick or two. Before we probably go block the strait. Even though, I, like I just was saying, I don't really want to send them over there, but. Oh. Well, maybe I don't want to block the strait, actually. There's not much to go across into here. Steel is really split up, aren't they? Look at that. If we could cause some rebellions to happen, they really probably can't handle it. Because look how many... Look how split up they are. Oh my gosh. What are they doing in the New World? Spain. Not doing too bad. They're actually doing... They're doing good in South America. North America, they're not doing that good. A Bretons, my gosh. They're really going good. Huh, alright, well. Let's keep converting. I mean... We still have soldiers, they're just not, not coming. Where's my navy? Probably not going to get here in time to help. But we'll send them over here because maybe they'll get there in time to help the knights. Sure. Guess if you want military access, you can have it. Oh, he helped a little bit. Bremen's just going to give up. Yeah, and give me some money. That's fine. Yeah, converting's coming along quite nicely. Very good. Uh, 
Oh, there's, under, there's 54 ships right here. Let's see if we can intercept them. And, oh, and we can sink some ships. Dang, we just sunk a pile of ships. All right, excellent. Get that colonial desire up. We don't want to fight for you anymore. Every time we go to war with you, we lose. Come on, hurry up and let's get there. There we go. They're in time to help. Oh, how'd that go? Not too bad. I don't know how many of these galleys are ours versus Austria's or anyone else's, though. Oh, we lost a few. That wasn't terrible, though. Overall, I mean, we won the battle, which is the big thing. How is that looking, anyways? Our uh, tradition. No, our naval tradition is still pretty bad. Even with the amount of fighting we do. <laughs> Alright, well. That's fine. Let's see, taking war score. I gained 15, 19 more by capturing Madrid, which we've done. We'll get more war score over time, too. How close are they to giving up? Close. Alright, well, let's turn the speed up, because I don't think we're going to do a lot more. How are we doing on navies? Oh, yeah, we've knocked them knocked them down significantly. We've sunk probably 100 ships of theirs at this point. Between, you know, all of our allies. Good. I don't think we're being sieged down anywhere or anything. Doesn't look like it. No. Oh. Oh, there are some armies over here. Interesting. I got 60,000 men there. They should easily be able to hold them off if they were dumb enough to come over there. Oh, what's this? Excuse me? Think you're doing yeah don't be trying to drop 50,000 men over here get that trash out of here um I mean I don't really feel like there's a lot more we need to do frankly I think we got this under control we'll just keep sinking their navy and let the ticking war score go up Oh wow, we've captured a lot of transports. Oh my gosh, we're gonna have a, a plenty of transports, that's for sure. Wow. Captured another transport. You know, I don't think we've built a heavy ship in this playthrough. But we've still got, what, how many? 17 of them, even though we haven't built one. 53 transports. How many more ships would we support? We'd support up to another 30. I think... We will do that. Or oh, this is 40? You know what? Build 40 more galleys. I'm okay with that. Especially because we can just go to buildings... Go to Grand Shipyard and build a couple of these. And ta-da, our naval problem will be fixed. <laughs> Navarra want to give up yet? There you go, Navarra. Go to my vessel, fine. Okay. And then, like I said, we're going to give a bunch of this to our vassal. We may have to actually probably take part of it and give it to them immediately. And then part of it take ourselves and give it to them later on. Just because of the fact that if I give it all to them like I did to me, if I give the AI 200% overextension, like, pfft, they're just goners. <sighs> And the AI probably wouldn't want to, they probably wouldn't be wanting to accept that deal. Ooh, surprise. 
Oh, we're getting all kinds of events. Blockade? Are you joking me? Really? I got a blockade event? What, because I for a second wasn't there? Like... <sighs> really? Where am I even being blockaded? Oh my goodness. Alright, game. It appears you're destroying Castile's navy. So I'm sure it means they're blockading me. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. All right. Oh, what's this? We got two more transports. Thanks for the free ships there, uh, Castile. You're a great guy. Um, we're not taking attrition anywhere, are we? No, no, we're in great shape. Oops, I didn't need to go there. I know where we're converting people. All right, well, looking nice. Oh, and our vassals are actually taking out some of this stuff. Wow, okay. Wow, how many soldiers does our vassal have? 100,000? We oh, yeah, the knights have 105,000. Dang, that's, that's a lot of soldiers. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter. The overall power, because we've got 550, isn't going to matter. But that's, that's a nice vassal to have. That's the nice thing about taking stuff from Spain, too, is Spain's Catholic... So, get a nice bit of stuff from them that way. Um, I think Killwa, we just need them to drop out. And they probably will eventually here, if we let a little more time go by. Once they drop out, that'll increase our... Oh, wait a second. Uh, just send this army over there to help, this navy over here to help. Oh, well, don't even have to worry about it. Never mind. That was the ticking war score. I can still get 10 more. Yeah, I might as well wait. Take as much from Madrid as we can. No, no desire to see uh, Spain keep anything. Oh, our golden era has ended. It's pretty good golden era, though. Crushed Ottomans, crushed Mamluks, crushed Spain. We can, we can deal with that. Oh. oh, we got two. Wow, we got two more heavies. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, the rich get richer, boys. Six, four, four. Dang. Our nation's not really mourning over the loss of our previous monarch. If we can get a six, four, four, I'll allow it. I'm going to take the crusade one again. And minus to 10% to aggressive expansion is really nice, too. That's the thing, because we stay, we're staying as controller, we're also getting that minus 20 to aggressive expansion. It's just... It's just huge. Um, I guess let's leave them there for now, because my ships are... Oh, well, they're not too bad, I guess. But they're a little beat up. We got our, th our 40 galleys almost done over there. Excellent. But yeah, we'll get Killwa out of the war. We'll get Killwa out of the war, and then we can get, uh... Make sure they're taking war scores all the way up. You go ahead, you want to get out of the war now? No, not yet. Yeah, so the second they... Get to low war, war enthusiasm, which is... Which is soon. Eventually they'll get the, uh... They'll start to get the penalty from a long war. And then they'll want to drop out. Okay, um... Portugal's just sitting over there like, that's what you get, Spain. Ooh, idea group, yay. Excellent. I don't want to construct the Suez Canal, I don't think. Could, but, well, I don't really want to. 
I think for sure we want to take admin. I don't really know what our last two ideas are going to be. Admin's probably really good. And maybe influence? That lowers liberty, desire, and subjects also. Which would be nice. Yeah, in influence might be nice. Maybe take admin and then influence. We took a lot of diplomatic ideas this time, but it really, truly really worked out good. We're going to take admin for now, though. Even though we'll have to save our... Uh, I'm not going to do Suez Canal. Go away. I'm going to have to save up some admin power right now. Anyways, what do we add anyways with our new leader? We got 14, 14, 11. Oh. That's good. Oh, hello. What is this? Um, no. Do not need you to take Madrid because, well, that'd be terrible since that's the poor war objective. Like, we'll start losing war score if we, uh... Don't deal with this. Okay, now we're good. Sure, go deal with that too for them. Sure, Spain does want to give up want to give up too with the, <laughs> the women we're giving them um Send those armies home, and then I'll probably have to leave these two armies somewhere around. Somewhere around here to just keep control of the area for now. Ooh, gain three innovativeness? Or, hmm. Gain three innovativeness, lose two mercantilism. I don't know if I want to lose that. I have 35 right now. Do I need innovativeness? No, let's just gain the mercantilism. My, my innovativeness is fine. Oh, we're starting to get call for peace, huh? Let's look at me if... Oh, no, Kilwa doesn't want to get out yet. We've almost got enough ticking war score, though. And Kilwa's at zero. War enthusiasm. Oh. Which means... Yep, we'll just let a few more months go by. Probably the beginning of the year. 1731, we can probably finish this. Great steering, plus 10%. Excellent. More conversions? How many more conversions do we have? Uh, quite a bit still. Even with five out of five a pop. We took a lot of territory from Mamelukes, though. Mm, side with clergy? Probably side with burgers, because the clergy can afford to take the hit. Yeah. Plus the Siege of Antwerpine. Uh, okay, wait a second, what? Oh, uh, rebels, I'm like, um, what? I know where Antwerpine is, and I'm like, I don't think we own that province. <laughs> we technically don't. We own it due to a war for a moment. Kilwa, there you go, Kilwa. Away with, away you get with you. Now we're at seventy-five percent. Excellent. Um. Oh, we've got another army up here. Shoot. Well, just send them over there for now. Let's go and see what we can do. Let's transfer that to them. Let's transfer that. That that maybe something like that and then i could take these provinces here to give to them later that's one two three four five six provinces that's quite a bit for the size they are to take um oh well we gotta wait 47 days <laughs> well, what's this guy doing why is he idle Targeting neighbors, idle, really. Wow. Okay, well, fine. 
All right, Spain. Actually, wait a second. What is our? Oh, we have no war exhaustion. It says we're we've calls for peace. Oh, it's barely there though. All right. So, uh, which provinces are they owning? These, these three, and these three. It's hard to it's hard to remember sometimes. These three and these three. How much more can we take? Oh, we can take a lot. Gosh, we can take a lot. Really? We can take this much? Really? Well, let's see if we can give a little bit extra to our... Our vassal. I wasn't going to. But, I mean... Could they take Madrid? We're going to reform Spain, kind of, as our vassal. They could. They could take that. Wow. How much more can I take? Oh, I can take all this. Oh, I can't. I can take this. They'd agree to this. Wow. That's really good. That puts us over on underextension, too. Or an overextension. We're not over 100%. Nice. All we have to do is defend our provinces and maybe help them defend theirs from rebels too, potentially, but this is huge. Wow, we'll take it. How much power? We gained 81 power projection. Oh, oh yes. Well, that's excellent. Um, do we want to core these? We could just give it to them, not cord. And let them deal with it. But I have to deal with the overextension and stuff. That, yeah, no, I'm going to start coring them. That's fine. I don't want to deal with that. We may have rebels, blah, blah, blah. That's all fine. And now that's, that's huge. Now we can eventually, I'm going to give all these... To my vassal? Or am I? You know what? We could just hold on to all these. No, I think I'm going to give all these to my vassal. I'm just going to have a big vassal over here. I don't need to take more land. I'm going to take more land over here. Like, I'm going to take all the Mameluke stuff. Adal, Yemen. Speaking of Yemen. No, we don't have enough. Well, we could start doing it. We just don't have enough opinion. Interesting. Okay, I was wondering. Well, eventually we could... We could absorb them. But, uh, yeah. I think this right here is a good spot to stop today. We're in a great... We're in great shape. We got exactly where we wanted to be, I think. Off screen, I'm just gonna let some time go by. We'll gather, you know, we'll core some provinces. I'll feed Avignon. We'll... And we will burn off some, uh... Burn off some stuff, some overextension and stuff. I don't think we really got much in the way of aggressive expansion there either. And allow our ourselves to, our conversions to get done too. We'll just let some of that boring stuff get done. And then uh, we'll plan what we're going to do next. Yeah, if you guys have any questions, comments, thoughts on the playthrough so far, let me know in the comments section below. And if there's any... Um, any country you'd like to see me play next, because we are nearing the end of this playthrough, uh, let me know. Maybe we can uh, try that one next time. Either way, thanks for watching. I hope to see you next time.